Yes, I do like Ike. Thank you, Ike. As you can already tell, I'm going to be using a Brave Ike in this one. Hi, nerds. I kind of forgot all about him uh, due to all of the E3 hype. I've been going crazy trying to make sure that he was... Uh, <laughs> I wasn't forgetting him, and then all of a sudden I was like, wait a second, we had GHB yesterday. Or today, I guess, and uh, E3 just kind of killed all of that. But this one's uh, this one's definitely a lot more interesting than I thought it would be, especially on this side down here, because that that drive speed kind of annoys me, and you know all this other fun stuff. I couldn't believe Linus has wrath of all things, which is just rude. But all in all, uh, this one really just kind of relied on me uh, using fast units who were using life and death. That's pretty much what I'm doing here to at least get rid of a lot of the problems. Um, didn't want to bring along a bow unit. I wanted to try and see if I could do it with a dagger unit. So we brought along South just for this occasion. And we're also bringing along Lind, who happens to have life and death and all this other jazz. Um, probably would be better to use Aura here, but uh, kind of forgot. Have Barblade instead. <laughs> or Blair Blade, whatever you want to call it. Now, the thing that I wanted to do here to make sure that everything was going well is I wanted to... Attack from two prongs here. At least for me, this is how I worked. How I worked it out. Um, but if you guys happen to have uh, any suggestions on what you did or how you won, do tell me in the comments. I would love to hear it. Soth is going to be used mostly just to uh, debuff, but also get his uh, special going because he does have heavy blade, at least as a seal equipped, and he has the attack to at least do quite a bit of damage. And now he has his special ready. Now, uh, this is where things got a little hairy before, but, uh, just, just because I cast a tank a bunch of stuff, but he does it rather well, honestly. Mostly due to, mostly due to the fact that there's one, that debuff on, uh, that thief there, but this Lance Dragoon, or <laughs> Dragoon, goddamn, it's not Final Fantasy, every time! Anyways, but this Lance Dragon, I was trying to solo this, like a true solo with fear, did not work because, of course, this lovely lady here, she was just disastrous in a lot of ways, but uh, here's how I ended up doing a lot of what, <laughs> what I ended up doing. To kill this uh, blue, to blue, ma yeah, blue tome unit, um, basically I just used Ike because he already had Aether and he was ready to go. And did that job pretty well. And ironically enough, um, the one thing that kills Linus is not technically uh, <laughs> any color advantage. It's just going to be destroying these targets here. And then that'll debuff Linus quite a bit. And then from there, pretty much, I just used Lind. At least I used Lind in a dance because, well, yeah. I mean, it's enough damage. We don't have to deal with him. And he already has Luna ready to go. So that's not a fun one, at least not to me. And I would rather not deal with that. <laughs> and then we just get rid of it. Get rid of him. And he's gone. And then from there, we just kind of mop up with the last bit. And it's, of course, the, uh, you know, dragon. We can do this either way. We could do this with Lind if we really felt like just demolishing them. We could do it not with Ike, because Ike will die, of course. But, uh, God, I was kind of hoping we could do it with Ike. But I think Soth deserves this. He kind of is the main reason that build, or at least that team, worked a bit better. His debuffs just were pure game there. It was amazing stuff. And, well, that's basically it for me. What did you guys do? How did you deal with, uh, you know, all this fun stuff? I have not had a chance to actually build Linus, so you know what? I'm gonna just do the Linus Mad Dog Lunatic real quick, and uh, we'll just continue discussing what's been going on. See, the funny thing is, I really, really tried very hard to get, Lin well, not Lind, but Fear to solo something. Like, I was really trying very hard. He, She could probably do this one relatively well, even against, uh, you know, that blue tome unit, she still handles herself quite fantastically, but the problem, of course, is when they add in that dragon rider unit that just has fortress defense and a bunch of other nonsense in there that just really destroys a lot of my uh, chances. Kind of sucks, but you know what? Oh well. <laughs> Anyways, let's, uh, let's just see how well this goes. We're gonna try this out a bit more, but man, that lance dragon just, oh, that, that really changes a lot going on there, honestly. You know, I'm just gonna continue to do the uh, strategy that I made here, and hopefully it works out, because it's Lunatic. Usually there's a little bit of modification when it comes to the AI when it, with Lunatic, but... Understood. Honestly, I would love to see how you guys did. If you happen to have any videos of, you know, yourselves doing Linus at all, 
send them my way. I would love to see it. And by the way, for those who are wondering, we will be having the uh, Choose Your... <laughs> not Choose Your Legends. Show Me Your Build. I wish it was Choose Your Legends. We'll be having Show Me Your Build just directly after this, actually. So if you're looking forward to that, uh, we should be starting that up fairly soon. So, yep. And then from there, we're going to just move on for the next thing, and the next thing, and the next thing. There's a lot of excitement going on. But Linus was not, honestly, I, I can safely say he was probably not as difficult as a lot of other GHBs, just because the only real problem I see is that there's a lot of enemy units packed in one spot, but if you happen to have a dancer and some fa fairly powerful units, or at least a fairly powerful nuker, like, uh, you know, Lind here, she doesn't even have life or death, uh, three, but even with that, she just destroys them. So, I'm sure there's probably people out there who've done it with, uh, you know, three dancers and one bow unit <laughs> knowing them. Okay, I kind of have to have Ike do this. Come on. He deserves to at least kill the red dragon. There you go, buddy. You did it. Well, there we go. That is a whole lot of nonsense. I'm sorry I didn't cover this when it came out, but good lord. What is up with him? Also, Someone told me that there's an error in his art or something? And I, you know what? I, I, I think I see it. I'm gonna zoom in just so you guys can tell, okay? This is this is not really something too crazy, but it's just something funny to me, so uh, let's try and see if we can't get that art. Just we're gonna try and zoom in. I don't know if you can see it but yet, okay? Ah, uh, do you see it yet? Ah, there it is. There's a little tiny green spot in his art. That's terrible. I know, right? It's just, it's god-awful. <laughs> that was literally what someone was complaining to me about. And then another person was like, hey, did you notice the art error? I'm like, yep. Sure did. Either way, ugh. Can't believe they left a green splotch on Linus. Ugh, nasty. Either way, enjoy your new axe unit, nerds. Tell me how you did it in the comments below. Bye.